going on, folks? Um, so I think Joe Rogan is um, copying Shannon Sharp, and I hear everybody talking about, man, Joe Rogan is, man, he's a three hundred million dollar, two hundred million dollar podcaster. He's he's not studying Shannon Sharp, right? But he just had Cat Williams on on his show. He just interviewed Cat Williams, and he hasn't ever interviewed Cat Williams like ever on his show. But you guys all heard, y'all saw that Shannon Sharp interviewed Cat Williams, and that interview did a ton of views, right? And even on the uh, interview uh, with Shannon Sharp and Cat Williams, Cat Williams was just like, man, I'm coming to you because I know Joe Rogan and all the other ones would never have me on, right? Because to them, they, they're chasing that viral moment as well. And even the history of Joe Rogan is very interesting. Him using the N-word repeatedly over and over again on his platform. Um, and I'm just, just finding it very interesting. I don't know why Cat Williams went on there, but, you know, it's up to him to where he, he, he wants to go. But he's just seeing that. Like, everybody's watching out, checking out for Shannon Sharp. Shannon Sharp played in the NFL at a high level. Now, after football, he's pivoting to media and now you're seeing everybody is trying to figure out how to have a Shannon Sharp type of moment from an interview game. He's passing all these guys, all of his peers, all the people that were laughing at him and saying, you can't do a podcast. Like, what are you going to talk about? What are you going to do? And he's moving to the next level. So at the end of the day, yes, Joe Rogan is huge uh, in his media space. But for some folks out there to say, oh, there's, there's no way Joe Rogan would copy someone like Shannon Sharp. I mean, Shannon Sharp is the biggest thing in media right now. Um, he is the biggest thing on um, First Take. He he has another show with um, Ocho Cinco. Um, he's also bringing in other folks as well. Um, and he got the Shay Shea podcast. So... At the end of the day, for somebody to say nobody's copying him, a ton of people are copying. I mean, a lot of the stuff we're seeing or hearing in the news has been broken on the Shannon Sharp podcast. And for our community, um, he is someone that is passing everyone. I'm glad he's around because usually people, well, all people go to DJ Vlad um, or go into these other spaces that is not our culture. But you have a black American of Shannon Sharp um, that is bringing um, our culture back into the forefront. So it's just very interesting to see. What are you guys' thoughts on it? I'm talking to my, um, you know, people that have been following, um, you know, Shannon Sharp and his rise in the media space. Do you think Joe Rogan is kind of like jumping on a bandwagon now? Because uh, he wasn't trying to interview uh, Cat Williams before. <laughs>